weather. Strong storms are headed this way, expected to bring flash flooding and high winds to some areas. Now, the storm has already impacted millions across the Midwest. This video was shot in Tyler, Texas earlier today, where heavy winds blew a roof off of a shed. Now here in the Tennessee Valley, we're already seeing rain and dark skies across the area. We have team coverage of those storms tonight. But first, let's check in with meteorologist Allison Pryor, who is live in the Storm Alert Center with the latest. Allison? Yes, we've already had scattered on and off showers and a few thunderstorms during the day today. I wanted to show you a current look at the radar as we move this through across our area. You can really see how we're starting to see some greater development from Chattanooga into the west. But I wanted you to really focus as I zoom out here. You can really see around the Birmingham area extending down to Mississippi where you have some of those purple colors. There's also flashing boxes. There are several active severe thunderstorm warnings and tornado warnings across the area. This whole entire system, that's what's going to be moving to the northeast and to our region later tonight and during the overnight hours. Now, there is a tornado watch that is already active for our counties that are in Alabama. So going through the area, and this is not the correct graphic that I wanted to show you going through, but uh, coming through for, I'm just going to step off screen really quickly and show you this. So for our tornado watch, it is going to be active uh, for our counties in Alabama at this time until 10 p.m. Central Time. We're not seeing any other activity right now as far as the tornado watches, but here's the severe threat across our region. So as we're looking at our timing, severe outlook from about 7 p.m. to 4 a.m. Kind of peak timing in between that is 8 p.m. tonight until 3 a.m. Most of our counties are at this level three enhanced risk across the area. That means numerous severe storms are possible, but look to the southwest of Chattanooga highlighted in this red color here. We do have some regions, Northeast Alabama, Dade, Walker County, Gordon County in Georgia. that are at that level four where widespread severe weather is possible. That includes the threat of tornadoes. So here's that tornado breakdown. Out. Number one thing I want you to take away from this map is every single county on here is colored in. We all have a chance for tornadoes for tonight, but particularly from Chattanooga, from Grundy County into the Blue Ridge Mountains and southwestward, you do have an elevated tornado risk. So where is that breaking down? Well, we're looking at the arrow right in between multiple possible and multiple very likely. Tornado is a main threat, but we're also talking about very strong straight line damaging winds. 30% chance of probability colored in the red in the purple color, 45%. So that means, yes, damage is very likely across our area. I'm going to have more details timing it all out going from west to east coming up in about 15 more minutes. Joy.